Outdoor Travel Channel with Robin Sherry. Hey Traeger fans, this is Rob. Today is a great day because I'm making a video on something I haven't cooked before. And it's called 321 Ribs. And the way it goes is uh, you smoke your ribs for three hours in the Traeger. Then we kind of bake them sealed in a tin foil kind of thing where uh, at a higher temperature than for the last for two hours and then for the last hour you pull them back out again and kind of uh, dry it out and get a, uh, a layer on it so it takes five hours so we're at the very beginning of this I have to turn on the trigger turn it to smoke and then I got to get the ribs ready and I'll show you what I'm going to use a mustard mix and seasoning and then we're going to smoke them for three hours. We'll go through the process together. It's kind of slow, but at the same time, they come out super yummy. And we'll be using brown sugar and honey, too, on the second stage. So here we go. So the first thing we're going to do is fire up the trigger to the smoke setting and get it up to 125 degrees and get our meat ready. I'll be using lemon, mustard, Winchester sauce, a pork seasoning, and a special garlic seasoning and putting it in a bowl. Now it's time to cook this thing at 125 degrees, smoking temperature for the Traeger for three hours. Oh yeah, I almost forgot to put the pork seasoning on. I do this, uh, I should have done this before, but we're doing it right now. Put it on pretty heavy because we want a nice layer. When the three hours is up, we're going to need some honey, some brown sugar, lay out some tin foil, and we're going to use apple juice, which I got in these convenient little containers. It's been three hours and it's time for the next process. At this point, we need to turn the trigger up to 225. Start adding your honey and then later your brown sugar. Time to start wrapping your ribs in the tin foil, but leave an opening to add your apple juice. Now that the Traeger is at 225, it's time to cook these in the apple juice for two hours. After the two hours, we're going to unwrap the ribs and then we're going to coat them with 
barbecue sauce. This is a honey barbecue sauce I'm using. Now it's time to slather this thing with lots of barbecue sauce because we want to cook on a nice glaze. Now it's time to glaze this thing at 225 for an hour. Just before the ribs are done, I decided to make some asparagus with olive oil and lemon pepper. While the asparagus was cooking, it was time to cut up the ribs. And they look wonderful and smell great. And it's time for dinner, folks. Does that look good or what? Hey, thank you for watching Outdoor Travel Channel and Cooking with Rob doing the 321 Trigger Pork Ribs. Yummy stuff. Hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe, like our videos, and share them with the world. Thanks for watching.